Deathmatch. Hello everybody, welcome to your faces back, welcome to another game of Infernal Game Tactics. This is a uh, just a good gameplay of me getting my canine unit. I think so, probably, uh, I don't know where it was. But yeah, my game of getting the canine unit and what it does and the new Call of Duty Ghost Info, what you're going to hear. This is in theta mode, so if you wonder everything's a bit dodgy, it's because theta mode's never been good on this game. So yeah, um, new things they're bringing out in new Call of Duty Ghost, new prestiges, new stuff like... I don't know, I think they're bringing back some of the old prestige albums because uh, I was watching it with the trailer and it popped up swinging across the air uh, a bit like it did in COD 4 or I think it was, no, World of War it was, it did a little swinging pass saying it was uh, 10 prestige emblems from MW2 so that may be coming back, there may be new prestiges in Call of Duty Ghost, we do not, we probably do I've already told you how the prestige and what the, uh, how the ways you are prestiging through and uh, new games and stuff and I hope you enjoy this gameplay and uh, please subscribe leave a like and everything and you'll get new Call of Duty news every day I'm trying to get more Call of Duty news and some of the new weapons that are coming out one I'm gonna tell you about one of the new weapons called the uh, K7 made by the Koreans or something like it and uh, it's completely suppressed it's built-in suppressor and you can't hear it, apparently it's pressed so uh, quiet that it's close to uh, no sound. And there's a new weapon, apparently it's equal to the uh, ACR from MW3, so... If there's a weapon like the ACR from MW3, I'm taking that. Because ACR was the best weapon in that whole game. That was just an amazing weapon. I think it's one of the best assault rifles ever invented in this game. Or the AK, but I cannot wait for that AK... T wait, I think it's AK-12, the new AK they brought into it. Because I haven't seen one AK-47 that's never been good in Call of Duty. AK-47 new Black Ops 1 was good. AK-74 in it, no, 47 in Black Ops 1 was good. AK-47 in MW1 was good. AK-47 in MW2 was good. AK-47 has always been good in this game, so... Yeah, I, it's probably a good thing, so when you get the score, it's doing it like you did it in Black Ops 1, I think, where... No, 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 it's actually not. I think you get the points from games because uh, the new perks, there's toughness, so you can get 11 slots like this, but there's 11 slots, so you can either, and the perks are all like 1 to 2 to points, the guns are 1 or 2 points, the secondaries are 1 or 2 points, so I'm probably not going to be using secondaries in that game, unless they're pretty good looking, or just to do a demo video for you guys on what the pistols are like. So this is probably the streak I get on the... Yeah, uh, MSMC. I knew there was a guy spawning there, but I should have just gone around. And I will be doing another live video today. Uh, I don't know what time. Probably, I don't know, about 8 or 9. These past few days, all I've been doing is watching uh, Lord of the Rings. You wouldn't expect me to like Lord of the Rings. I don't really like it. I just... I like the battles. I like the battles. They're just badass stuff. They're like shitloads of massive animals just beating the hell out of everyone. It's just cool. That is the only thing I like about it. I don't like them. They're just running about looking for Gandalf for about two hours. That's boring, or Gollum, or whatever his name is. No, no, Frodo. No, it's not Frodo. It's uh, Gollum and Smeagol. Smeagol. <laughs> Smeagol's epic. Except he burns at the end, probably. So I think the last one's on tonight. Or it's Return of the King. I don't know what what one that is. That's probably the one with the big guys and the big elephants beating the shit out of everyone. That's probably my favorite one. I don't even like this stuff. And I'm a massive fan of Star Wars. Star Wars is just my favorite game um, video ever and game. I think there's a new Star Wars video game coming out made by DICE this year, I don't know when, but there was a uh, video of it on YouTube, the new Star Wars Battlefront, I think it's Battlefront, they're normally called Battlefront though, ain't they? So, I think it's called Battlefront, I didn't even see this guy here, look, he's like, yeah, peekaboo, I, can, I didn't see that guy for some reason, I should have seen him first time. Uh, so yeah, and, um, so Star Wars, that... If there is a new Star Wars game going out, I am buying that game because I love Star Wars. I just Chewbacca, the little furry midget people. I just I love the fact that they can do that kind of stuff. It's so cool. And uh, what else? Um, I knew there was a sniper down there, so I turned around. Um, what else is coming out of the year? Centro 4, there's already a person doing the video of Centro 4. Centro 4 comes out in a few more days. I think it's Saturday it comes out. Like it. Um, there I get my K9 unit, like a boss. And still didn't get that guy because of the damn sniper. And uh, what else? There will be. Well, Sandra 4, Cod Ghost, Battlefield Force coming out, which I have no idea. No one's uploading stuff. Like, they're not like Call of Duty, though. They never really upload anything. Camper line on the floor right behind you. Wow. Skills, mate. 
So yeah, Battlefield 4 will be coming out today. I have no info on that. I am a big Battlefield fan, but they it literally they haven't they don't do much really, do they? Like they brought the Huey back into it, but I don't think the Huey ever was. I never played Battlefield 2 or 1944. I never played them once. I I only got six freaking dog kills in this game, but oh well. Thanks for watching and subscribe, and I'll leave you with final kill cam. Thank you and goodbye.